Pastel bells, pastel sparkles, pastels all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride with my cutie girls on a sleigh. Hey! Hello fellow doll lovers, Barbie Nation here, welcome back to my channel. Hello everyone, thank you so much for tuning into another video with me today. My name is Aryan, aka Barbie Nation, and what I do is I collect dolls, I play with dolls, I talk about dolls, and every now and then I give them a super cute makeover. So if you're into anything cute, sweet, and petite, definitely subscribe to my channel to get some lovely pastel glitters on your feed. Now let's dive into this color reveal advent calendar today. Ho, ho, ho. Here we go. Here we are again, Barbie color reveal advent calendar. Now, last year I also did a video about the advent calendar and it surprised me so much. I loved it all the way and I loved all the little things that came with it. So of course I couldn't uh, deny this year's advent calendar from the color reveal Barbie series. It's a less exclusive option because I'm still waiting for the Barbie limited edition 12 days of Christmas advent calendar with the uh, somewhat sort of silkstone Barbie. Yeah, so I'm very excited about that, of course, and I really, really hope it arrives before Christmas so I can share it with you all. But until then, I thought it'd be fun to show you guys the advent calendar from the color reveal series, which is a very cute alternative option. It is the same as last year, so this box is actually kind of like a whole diorama, if you will. You can uh, slide it open. Well, it's not really sliding. So you can open it in front and it creates kind of like this diorama setting, as you can see. And the little tabs that you can take off for every day actually can be placed on these uh, carton boards. So you can have like a whole setting with all of these cute figures with a super cute Christmas tree here in the middle that you can fold out. But I am here, of course, for all of these super cute accessories and the uh, cute clothing pieces that this set comes with. So yeah, cannot wait to put everything together to create a perfect cutie wintry pastel cutie girl, of course. So before I'm diving into this super fun advent calendar, I just want to introduce you guys to the girl, the model, <laughs> that is going to show off all of these items because aside from the color reveal doll that's inside this uh, advent calendar which is a really pretty doll on its own but you know she doesn't quite have the movement i would like in my doll and i received uh a package from wendy meter one of my lovely subscribers hey girl hey and she sent me a rerouted project of hers which is so perfect for all of the things that this set comes with that I want to combine those two together. She actually has an Instagram page. It's called Perfume Delight 66 and it's amazing. The reroutes that she does, I mean, she does some amazing work on these girls. Yeah, so she sent me a rerouted version of the Barbie Lux Andra doll, which is the platinum blonde with a pixie cut. And I need to introduce you to this new and improved Andra. She has gorgeous, enchanting, long pastel hair. And I was just like, 
totally like uh, when I opened that package and saw the length of this super cute gorgeously pastel hair I had to stare at it you know like this this blank amazed stare for like 10 minutes so here she is the new and improved super cute Andre doll Yes, can we take a moment to admire this new and improved version of hers? Check out this hair. So she has this icy blue mint color on one side, then this lavender pastel purple on the other side, and she re rooted the back of the head with pastel pink. So, you know, look at all these colors. She just looks so gorgeous. So me, I am so happy because, you know, I have been struggling uh, with my rebooting skills. So <laughs> I am so happy that you did this for me, Wendy. Seriously, so grateful and so surprised you sent her over and uh, I am obsessed with her. I know I say that about every doll, but seriously, check out her Instagram page. Wendy, thank you so much. Cannot wait to give all of these cute items to this doll and uh, give her a super cute wintry pastel look and she will for sure be on my display shelf really soon. Okay, so over to the advent calendar. The rules of the advent calendars, of course, is that you open one every day. So for every day leading up to December 25th, Christmas Day, you can you get to open one present. But yeah. I'm not that patient and I really just want to show everything to you guys. So we're just going to speed through December with this calendar and of course, you know, unbox everything. I mean, duh. Let's go with number one. And there are actually like these little perforated holes on the sides so you can, you know, gently get those tabs out. Okay. Got it. Behind door number one was a cute little feeding cup for the pets that are inside, which is super cute pastel pink. Number two. Okay, so I kind of messed up already. Number two, just got a little, yeah. Number two are these pastel blue earrings, which are very adorable. I love these earrings, actually. They look like really, they look like giant crystals and over to number three, which is a adorable little Christmas tree. Behind number three is this tiny, tiny little owl. Over to number four. Okay, this one really came out perfectly in one go. Yay. And it's uh, this pink necklace and yeah. These are pretty much all recycled items, by the way. Uh, because I've seen this necklace before as as well as the um, earrings. All I can say is my kind of color. On to number five. Which is also a fun little ski loft. And it holds these white cutie heels. These are the heels with the little ribbon on the front. Very cute. Yeah, but they are kind of like that super soft kind of rubber that really bends those heels really, really easily. As you can see, that's kind of a bummer because it usually um, it doesn't bring the doll that much uh, stability. You know, when you want to position them standing up in a diorama, <laughs> they are not helping when you're doing that. <laughs> Off to number six. But number six is the... A super cute a carriage over here. Well, I said carriage, but it's of course a sleigh. And it holds some very horrible proppy hair, but I mean, uh, the coloring is perfect. It is just a cotton candy perfection. Yeah, but of course the quality is horrible. Number seven. Number seven is again another tree, and it has this adorable little gift present thing, which can open on the top, and you can position it like half open. 
which could also mean that you could probably put like some cute puppy inside that will come out of the packaging, which of course is freaking adorable. Loving it. On to number eight. A festive Christmas tree. Ooh, the first piece of fashion, which is a adorable baby doll kind of like dress with puffy sleeves, pastel blue and silver stars on it. Okay, you can probably hear. The fabric, of course, is very plasticky, but it is the sturdy, okay kind. This is the kind you're, you can style this pretty easily. And it looks like this will fit any type of body, so that's also very nice. So adorable! Number nine. Number nine is a white little kitty, super adorable. And it came with these uh, lavender purple earrings. I don't know if you can see it very well. This is actually, this is a new earring mold for me. It has this uh, kind of like icy snowflake pattern in the middle. Yeah, I think they're really adorable. On to number 10, which is an adorable little deer. It came with this gingerbread man on a, well, a gingerbread man cookie on a plate because of course Christmas is not Christmas without gingerbread man cookies. Number 11, right down here, and it has the color reveal logo. So that probably will mean that there's a color reveal pet in there. As you can see, here it is. I was right. Oh, uh, it's a kitty. It's probably that white kitty that we saw on the animation picture thing, cardboard, whatever. Yeah, we're gonna check that out later. We're down to number 12. Also is a cute little deer and another piece of hair. Um, yeah. Again, I am so loving all of these colors together. And for some reason, it's actually better than the curled up piece because that really makes it super frizzy. This one actually feels really soft and um, much less cheap for some reason, but still it's very much poppy hair. Yeah. Still hating on it. Maybe not. I don't know. <sighs> I'm conflicted. Alrighty, number 13. We got some boots. It was behind this Christmas tree. Well, not a Christmas tree, but you know, snow covered. Yeah, you get the idea. And it has these pastel pink boots. <laughs> the boots, they're kind of like um, half cowboy, half cute. I don't know, can't wait to see these styled with a very cute look. So number 14 is next. Which was behind this cute little owl. It has a adorable super tiny purse in pastel pink <laughs> with a kind of like a gem closing on it. Very, very adorable. This mini purse gets me every time. On to number 15 which was behind this Christmas tree and another piece of fashion. I am loving this winter coat. Oh my gosh, with the fur trimming. Is it called trimming? I don't know, a fur sleeve? No. A fur collar? Yeah. A faux fur collar, of course. And it even has some, um, it even has kind of like this waistband. So the shape of this coat really uh, accentuates her waistline so that's really cute I love that and it's it's really nice this it's it's this cottony kind of fabric so that's really nice can't wait to see this on a doll number 16 number 16 is the big one in the corner with the castle so we're gonna get a big one now probably another bigger pet or something 
So it was this castle and it had an adorable deer inside. Oh my gosh, it's really cutesy, animated and childlike. I know, but it's so cute. Aww. I really love this. Number 17 is next. Which was behind this blue little fox thingy. It held a pastel blue mug with hot chocolate inside and whipped cream topping. Number 18, which had this funny little squirrel and another piece of fashion, yay, which is this pastel blue gingham, 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 I always say that wrong, um, checkered pattern. Yeah, pastel blue with pink linings on it. Adorable. Okay, number 19. We have another sleigh silver necklace that has a little bow detail. Very cute and adorable. Number 20. Oops. Which are these little furry friends? And it had this uh, silver bracelet inside. Adorbs. 21. Uh, which was behind this fuzzy little bear and also came with boots. <laughs> I think I have a pair of these in pastel pink, so that is just perfect. You can never have too many cute boots for your dolls, right? 22, which was behind this snowy pine tree and it held a pastel blue ring for you. Let's see if I can fit it. I can actually, it even fits me. That's really bad. Yeah, I have just really skinny, wrists and just very tiny hands for some reason. Let's continue. We're on to number 23, which was also a cute wintry cabin. It is a, I think a waistband in pastel pink with a ribbon bow in the front. Very cute. We can always use a good belt or a good piece to hold down to shape those oversized t-shirts Barbie keeps giving us. So um, yeah, perfect. And the last one, number 24, which was also a cute little cabin. The final piece of fashion, which is a adorable wintery patterned skirt. Loving these colors. Fabric is actually pretty nice. Uh, well, not top quality or anything, but you know, for Barbie standards, okay. So now we're right down to the color reveal part. Let's get this baby out. <laughs> so soon. I never get this right. Okay. Oh, I don't even want to reveal her anymore. She looks great. You could just stick her into the Christmas tree and she looks like a Christmas decoration on itself. But as you know, these are the really hard, hard plastic type dolls and you can really only just pull their arms up and down the same goes for the legs. Well, not completely up and down, but just, yeah. So the range of motion is very limited on these dolls. I really don't want to reveal her. <laughs> She looks way too cute. Of course I'm gonna reveal her, but it's a shame because it really has my favorite theming on a doll. Okay, let's get some water.
so she has been revealed. And of course, we get to see a super pastel layered girl underneath with pink hair, a blue bathing suit with uh, snowflakes on it, and lavender glittered legs. Uh, so the kitty was, yes, a super white, uh, snowflakey kitty. Well, okay. From now on, this kitty is called Snowflake. In color theming, this is just perfection. But in terms of quality and such, yeah, not so much. So everything's out of the calendar. We've revealed the color reveal features. I guess there's only just one thing left to do. I've got my new and improved, perfectly pastel rerouted Andra doll here from Wendy. I've got my stuff. We are going to give her the Barbie Nation makeover she definitely deserves. Here we go! So that was my Barbie color reveal advent calendar 2022 lookbook for this year. I don't even have a favorite out of these three looks. I really love them equally. Maybe a slight preference for the, the last look because I just love that coat so much. But I also really love that first look and I thought the second look was also really cute. So I really am unable to make a choice actually. And as Especially paired with that uh, rerouted Barbie Looks doll. I mean, uh, Wendy, thank you so much for putting all this effort into this reroute and giving her the perfect pair of pastel coloring in her hair. She really is a standout in my collection, in my opinion, so I will be forever grateful. It's just a really fun box filled with so many cute stuff. Uh, I mean, if you're not a fan of the color reveal dolls, I mean, I get you because I have 
the same issue with them but the stuff that it comes with and the fashions that you can mix and match around on other dolls it really is just a super fun Christmassy December holiday set. Of course, let me know down in the comments below if you are getting this set. Uh, what did you think were the cutest items in this set? Do you like the looks that I created? What do you think of the reroute of Andra here? Let me know in the comments below. Let's talk about this super cute Holly Jolly Pastelli advent calendar. <laughs> oh, and this this hair and those twist braids, the cute little details in her hair. I just love this girl so much. Oh, we are going to have some super pastel holidays this year and I am going to live for every moment that I'm seeing her in my room. So um, catch you guys in the next one and hope you have a very lovely, warm and loving holiday together. Mwah. Okay, so that's it for today, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. If you like this video, then please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And of course, click the bell icon next to the subscribe button to get notified by any new videos that I upload. You can also follow me on Instagram at Barbie Nation. That's usually where I post all of my updates. And until the next video, mwah, big kisses from me and I love you all.